everybody and welcome to the lazy organized mom um i am like super red you can see my face we have been running around all day it is like super like hot um heat index makes it feel like 100 107 here we want to go swimming we have zero shade around our pool so i'm going to make some shade i already had some pvc pipe and i had to go and purchase um sorry excuse that stuff in the back it's gotta go in the camper i went and i got a tarp um to go up over the pool for the shade. I'm gonna connect it to the PVC pipe. And then since it's the end of the season, Walmart has like all their stuff super cheap. So I got these really um, amazing uh, planters. Here's this one, then this one will go in the middle. And then I have, oops, sorry. And then this one will go on top of that one. So it'll be like a three tier type of thing. And then the PVC pipe will be in this one, and I'll have the plants around the middle of those. And then the PVC pipe will go up, the canopy, the tarp will be attached to those, and then attached to the fence, and it should cover the entire pool. And then it's also, I'm going to make it easy enough to where if we don't want the shade, you can just take the PVC pipe out. Um, the two, the big planter and the medium planter are going to have flowers and soil in them. Then the third small planter with the PVC pipe is just going to have rock. So it's easy to take it out and we can move it over the pool and to the other side. And that way if we, you know, if it's not like super hot and we want the sun to warm the pool up, we can do that as well. So I'm trying to make it, you know, versatile and everything. So let me go show you what the pool area looks like now. It's hideous. I can't stand it. My husband sprayed for weeds all the way around our pool. I was not happy. It was so bad because it killed all of our grass. And now it's like all muddy. Like, look. Like right here some. I mean, he just like dripped it everywhere. And then our dog pees over here all the time, so that's not good. But see like all this dirt like right around there? Um, that's all gonna be gone next year. Um, when I set the pool up, I wasn't really thinking. I should have pushed it all the way over to that side over there, to that corner, because there's rocks there. And then all these rocks here, I'm going to take and put them around the pool. And then that's where I'm gonna put my garden next year. Uh, we just moved in, so I'm not trying to like be like everything's got to be done. And like, no, it's step by step. But I really want the shade. Like, it is serious. It is so hot right now. I'm sweating, and I've barely even been outside very long. This is like where I just kind of decided I'd put like the PVC pipe. It's away from the ladder. Kids like to jump, and it'll be high enough so that way if the kids do get on the ladder and jump off, then they can. I know I'm not safe, whatever, but who cares? They're having fun, right? They're leaving me alone. <laughs> so, um. Just stay tuned and I will show you how the process goes and then the finished product. Come on, just come inside. So stay tuned and hopefully I will be in the pool soon. Because look, no, look how my face is just from being outside. Crazy hot. Stay tuned. Um, my project is not quite finished, but I uh, just want to show you where I'm at now because it'll take me a few days to finish what I want to do because I need to go get some tiki torches. I need to go get some river rock to make a little path and some hooks for the fence. And I'm kind of waiting for some things to like go on sale. So it might take a little bit. I'm going to go ahead and show you my finished project. Oh, and my house is a disaster. I completely didn't do anything yesterday. Sorry, it's like kind of really bright out right now. But um, I didn't do anything at all in the house yesterday. Like I left the groceries out on the counter I still have to put away. I mean, it's crazy, but it was totally worth it because today's gonna be another hot day. It's already hot out. Like I'm already like getting like the sticky, sweaty, gross feeling. So I just wanna show you my finished project. Um, as you can see, I have a little tarp up there. Um, I'll show you some of the pictures on like how I hung it up. I had to cut it. It was a pain in the butt. It's. I mean, I'm not like in love with it. I'm really not, <laughs> but I'm gonna wait and see if maybe I can find like um, a different type of tarp maybe online or maybe see if I can find like a really big shower curtain or like with a cool design on it. But for now, I mean, it works great. It's blue, just like the pool. Or, ooh, actually Menards has these uh, bamboo, like a uh, type of um, fence looking things. Maybe I could build something like that. I don't know, we'll figure it out. But for now, for this and the rest of the year, this is how it's going to be next year. It's, it'll be different. But I mean, I like it. I think it looks pretty good. I want to get a couple tiki torches. I want to get like a little rock path going from the deck up to the ladder. So I think it's pretty good. Um, it was a pain in the butt. My husband was kind of laughing at me, telling me I was kind of, you know, hillbilly or whatever. But I think it 
turn out pretty good for the rest of the year to work. And then next year, like I said, I'll get something different. I can't fit under it very good, but I can sit under it if I want to and swim. Um, so, but the little ones, I mean, they can. Hunter was in already today. We've already been in it, checking it out. So, at least we'll have some shade when it's hot out and we don't want to be scorching hot. So. so, one thing I love about my pool is I made it to where if we don't want the shade, we don't have to have it. Like, these pools here pull out really easily. Um, these ones here are just in the dirt. I can pull the stakes up and then just wind it all up and move it back to the back corner of the fence there and we don't have to have the shade. And then when we do want it, we just bring the bamboo sticks out, stick where they need to go, put the stakes in, and then we have shade. So I just wanted something that was like versatile. We can use it, we don't have to use it. Uh, you know, stuff like that. So um, that's another reason why I tried to make it as, I don't wanna say janky, but you know what I mean. I just wanted it to be versatile so we don't have to use it if we don't want to. Or if there's like a really bad storm coming, I can put it up. So I don't have to worry about it getting ruined and, you know, not tearing up the plants and stuff. So uh, thanks for staying tuned. Hope you enjoyed. If you like it, please make sure you subscribe, like, and share the video. Thanks.